Now we're going to approach the right to left Shondell. Remember, in the right to left shot, when you mount the gun ahead of the bird, you're going to be looking at that bird with both eyes across the top of the muzzle, across the top of the rib. You got to see it across the muzzle for the gun to be in front and your eyes to be on the bird on a right to left shot. You'll have to be looking at it across the muzzle. That is if you're right handed. If you're left handed, you're looking at it to the right of the muzzle. I know the horizon's a little crooked. I guess I had one foot in a hole or something. Watch this shot as it happens. That would be a rabbit target as a Shondell. Rabbit targets when they're thrown as a Shondell do not slow down as fast as a normal target. They always take lead. Be sure you're well in front if it's a rabbit. It's also going to really accelerate as it comes out of the roll and starts accelerating to the ground. It's going to accelerate faster. Um, it will appear to accelerate a lot faster than a, a, uh, a cup target because it has no drag. It has a better ballistic coefficient. Now let's look at this shot. I'm going to bring this target. All right, I'm going to go fast to show you. You see how it's an arcing shot? See it? But you notice, when I see the bird, if you'll notice, I'm still, right, the minute I see that bird, where's the gun go? The gun goes this way. Target's going this way. The instant I see that bird, the instant I see that bird, I'm going where it's going. This allows me to make the bird slow down. Now watch it. Watch it. All right, the gun's mounted. The gun's mounted right there. Okay, now watch. I'm going to continue going left as the bird begins to close on the gun, and I know the gun speed and the bird speed are the same. Look where I take the shot. Look at the sight picture when I take the shot. Most people will miss this bird because when they take the shot, they're going to put the gun right there. They think the bird's going to 7 o'clock. It is going down, but for every foot it goes down, it moves 25 feet to the left. If it's a rabbit, it moves 15 feet to the left if it's a normal size cup target, okay? Curling targets are not droppers. They should be shot as crossers. Watch it. Comes together, we take the shot. All right, watch now. Moving the gun to the left slows the bird down. Watch it. Here it goes. Watch. Here we go. Mount. Slow it down. You see how the bird is coming to me. And again, we are looking at this bird. The gun is pointed right here. Okay? The eyes are seeing the bird to the right of the gun. You see that? They have to be looking at the bird across the barrel for the barrel to be ahead and the bird to be behind the gun. Imperative that you practice that sight picture. You always want to see the bird somewhere behind the barrel as you make the insertion. This will make your eyes tend to stay on the bird more. Here it comes. Same speed. And you see how the gun accelerating to the speed of the bird makes the bird appear to slow down. Awesome.